So this question is a diagram question. Any question that provides some visual input, I'm going to call a diagram question. So we see here that we have uh, perpendicular lines, right? We have line segment BC and we have line segment AD and those two lines are perpendicular to each other because we see this right angle formed at the point where they intersect and we have angle that is x degrees and 2x degrees and another 2x degrees and we know right we know that this side of the angle that i have in red here must also be 90 degrees so that tells me that the x plus 2x plus 2x has to equal a total of 90 degrees now x plus 2x plus 2x is 5x is equal to 90 degrees and then i can just divide both sides by 5 here. And again, if you don't know what 90 divided by 5 is, this is not the calculator section, so we'd actually have to do the work. So I'll just show you on the side here. 5 goes into 9 once. 5 there. Subtract it. 9 minus 5 is 4. Bring down the 0. 5 goes into 48 times. So what we have here is that x is equal to 18 degrees. Now notice I did all of that without reading the question because that's what I want to do whenever I see a diagram question. I want to say, well, what did they give me and how can I, like, what can I find out of the information that's provided to me? So let's look at the question now. The question says in the figure above, point B, right, let me just erase everything so we can clearly see where all the points are. Point B, which is here, lies on AD. What is the value of 3x? Well, we know that x is equal to 18 degrees, so that means 3x is equal to 3 times 18 degrees. 3 times 18, again, not the calculator section, so maybe you know it by heart. That's great. If not, I just want to show you how to do the math here. 3 times 8 is 24. 3 times 1 is 3, plus 2 is 5. So 3x is equal to 54, and therefore the correct answer here is choice C.